Hi everyone! I'm back today with a short video for you all. So today I'm going to be talking about the new Oxbow food that I found at the pet store yesterday. So I went to the pet store yesterday because I needed food for my pigs. Because as you can see this one is almost out and I have four pigs. And I did not find the Oxbow Essentials Cappy Cuisine anymore, but instead I found this new one, which is the Oxbow Natural Science Adult Guinea Pig Food. Now, I had seen this food a while ago on the Oxbow website, because I go there often to see what new stuff they have, but I have never actually seen it in pet stores, and this was the first time I actually found it there. So I decided to buy it, because what I had read on the Oxbow website about it was pretty good, and it looks seems to be more natural than this one, so I decided to get it and give it a try and see if the pigs like it. So this is what it looks like. Oxbow, natural science, the little guinea pig in the front, adult guinea pig food, with Timothy Orchard and Oat Hay sources support, digestive and dental health, contains all natural antioxidants and omega-3 and 6 fatty acids, prebiotics, support a healthy gastrointestinal system, and stabilize vitamin C helps pre prevent d deficiency. So when comparing these two, I think the difference between these is that this one seems to have more different hay sources in there. This one only has Timothy hay, Timothy meal, while this one has Timothy orchard and oat hay sources, which is really good for them and is more similar to what they the food they would actually find in the wild. On the back. Here's what it says specially formulated with stabilized vitamin C and other high quality ingredients selected to enhance the overall wellness of your adult guinea pig. When fed as a maintenance food along with unlimited grass, hay, and water, natural science adult guinea pig food provides all of the necessary nutrients to help a guinea pig thrive. As part of the Natural Science Individualized Nutrition Program, this food provides the backbone of nutritive care. And here it has a table of the natural science of this food. It has healthy protein and fat sources such as flax, yellow pea, and canola for muscle health and energy. Um, flax and canola omega-3 and 6 for skin, coat, renal, and cardiac health. Um, yeast, inulin, prebiotics for digestive health. Um, vitamin A, C, D, E, B complex vitamins, chelated uh, minerals, as vitamin and minerals for all body systems, and Timothy hay, oat gray, sorry, oat hay, orchard grass, tomato pumice, as high fiber sources for digestive function and dental health. Okay, now in regards to the appearance, both of these foods look very similar to each other. The essentials, as you can see, are little pellets with no colorful bits of junk food. And this one doesn't have any colorful bits either. It's just little pellets as well. They're just a bit thicker than these. Let's get some and show you the difference. This is the essentials ones. As you can see, and these are the natural science ones, so they look pretty much the same, same color. These are just a bit smaller. Okay, so in appearance, both of these pretty much look the same. However, where you can really tell the difference is in the smell of the food. The essentials one smells pretty much like any other guinea pig food you could buy. It doesn't smell like hay as much as this one does. This one, when you sniff it, it smells like you're walking through an orchard. I'm assuming it smells like orchard grass, so it smells more natural than this one does. So it's very nice. So, yeah, I bought it yesterday and I gave the pigs a bit of it mixed with this food. It just mixed a third of their daily food allowance third of this one into the rest of this and there didn't seem to be any complaints about it. They ate it, all of it, so 
Yeah, I, I'm thinking that if they like this food, I'll just switch to this one permanently because it seems to be a lot more natural and seems to be a lot better for them. So yeah, if you go to the pet store and see this food, I would recommend you give it a try and see what you think. My pigs seem to like it so far, so I think I'm gonna keep them on this if they like it. And they also have a bunny one of this one too, Natural Science, so if you have a rabbit, you may want to look into this brand as well. So yeah, that was my short video for you all. Thank you for watching. Um, now that said, uh, the next video I'm going to be making is about my organization because it was requested. And then I am going to make a hedgehog diet video because it was requested as well. And I wanted to do one of those for a while because a lot of the stuff that they sell at pet stores for hedgehogs are really really bad for them so their diet is a bit misunderstood all right so thank you for watching have a fabulous weekend and i will see you all in my next video please comment like and subscribe bye